Oh, hey, Josh from Nesford Trails Off-Road. Today, we're on the Wild Horse Trail here in the beautiful deserts of Utah, and this is near the San Rafael Swell. And this trail is a overlander's paradise, and it's just amazing scenic views, and as you can see, some old historic buildings. Now, we're gonna head down this trail, see what it's like, so why don't you sit back, stay tuned, and enjoy this video. Wow, this thing just got a lot more interesting around this curve, and there is just this amazing strata. We were discussing what the white lines were, and my guess, not a geologist, is that we're looking at the bottom of an inland sea or lake, and so the white lines is essentially limestone, if you will. Crustaceans, things that had shells, died, all of those little critters, fell to the bottom and you create a small layer. Fairly stable time inside the sea or lake. Then you get mud, silt, sand that washes in and creates another layer. Fairly stable time again, another little layer of dead critters. More mud, sand washes in, compacts down, another little layer of dead critters. And this goes on and on and on and on and on for millennia. And we get to see a cross section of what was originally flat. This has fallen off from the top. And so if you see, it's repeated all up there. And so we see these white lines where it's really, really flaky stuff. That's my guess. Then you have the quartz extrusions. They're not laid like this. That was stuff that came up from below and forced its way up through small fissures or faults and uh, was pushing its way from down below up towards the surface. So one of the things I actually found quite surprising is like, I didn't, this is the first time I've been on this trail but is the geological structures of the mountains. And it's clear this used to be some kind of river. And, but the, the weird thing is, is it's a fault line too, because there's evidence of uh, ground shear, or the shear in the mountainsides. And you can see the different levels, like how it's been pushed up and, and or torn down over the years. And, and it's using like quartz or something like that, something very thin and narrow to divide the two. It's pretty wicked and really cool. Um, and it's just amazing, you know, just look around and enjoy the view around you. Cause you know, honestly, if I was just driving a trail, I would have never even looked off to the side and saw this stuff. To keep my eye open for like good film opportunities, Josh. And that's Todd, we're, you know, we're out here filming so you guys can enjoy these videos. And, you know, and better yet, we hope you guys come out here and experience this yourself. Go to the website, go to www.trailsoffer.com and look up this trail. And just come out and live this yourself because the video is great, but living it is unbeatable. We're gonna keep going on the trail, Let's see what's ahead of us. Need to see some homestead out in the middle of nowhere. Not really sure when it was built from the store behind it. We'll try to research it later. If you know, comment below. We're gonna head over to Muddy Creek Crossing. Uh, if we actually ran into someone saying they weren't comfortable crossing, but we were upstream just the other day and the water wasn't very deep. So I'm not too stressed about crossing it, especially with the 37 Falcons on this bad boy. But uh, we'll see what it looks like, you know. It's best to be safe, so I'll take a look. 
feel uncomfortable, we'll turn around and head back out. We're at Muddy Creek Crossing, and as you can see, it's steep and squishy. Might not be able to make it. Might be able to. I'm going to back up and just sort of see what we got here right now. So, uh, What I did is I purposely put the Jeep in a spot where I know I won't get stuck. But that's the problem with the mud out here. It's like I mean, look at this. A little bit of throttle. Once this problem. happens, yeah. it's, it's game over. Well, we got two across, now it's my turn, let's go. Go back and cross the other one. <laughs> I think you're right, I think no. you're gonna come from the other direction. <laughs> We're, it's starting to get We're to gonna it. go get burgers. Yeah. <laughs> Well, no, I busted my. That's my adrenaline got pumping when I fell. I got busted. I'm spitting water out my forehead. Yeah, it's uh, it's hot and we're getting hangry. What do you think of the mud crossing? Man, I love this trail. You can see so much. The terrain is so interesting. This river crossing, I did it before. It was different this time. A little more tame this time. Don't try it alone. Make sure you have good mud terrains. You heard it. I said bye, Falcons. <laughs> Cooper, we're gonna head up trail. Someone said burgers. I'm hungry. Let's go.